Police are looking for two suspects who shot a store clerk during a robbery at a smoke shop in East Harlem. CBS 2's Christy Kalishian spoke with a witness and has new surveillance video. With their hoodies, masks, and gloves on, they seemingly walked into Essex Convenience like any other customer Friday night at around 11.15, just before closing. But then they bolted, gun pointed at Tariq Nieves, a friend of the employees here who didn't wish to be identified on camera, while the other demanded items from the clerk behind the counter. So he hits me in the head with the pistol and then takes me back there, puts me on the floor, has me empty out all my pockets, so I emptied out everything. Nieves ended up getting two staples on his head. The employee behind the counter, who doesn't want to be identified, was shot in the groin and stabbed multiple times. He was taken to Harlem Hospital and is now recovering. I was like, this guy has a gun and a knife. It's like, it's over at this point so and then I locked myself back there waited till people came the two fled up East 116th Street with nothing just before cops arrived the smoke shop and convenience stores manager Saturday morning says all the money and items taken from the victims pockets were recovered we'll catch up to them eventually and they will pay the price Normally, the entrance is locked, customers needing to be buzzed in by the clerk. But Friday night, the employee eased up and left the doors unlocked when the two got in. Yes, you can't get too comfortable in a smoke shop, too. You can't be on the phone just looking down for 10, 15 minutes at a time. And then that happens, you look up, they're already in here. Sometimes it's too late. The whole ordeal lasted about three minutes. Essex Convenience has only been open for less than a year. Its manager says no employees will be allowed to keep doors unlocked or let anyone in with their faces covered. I personally if you're like, if you don't know the customer about today, don't let a stranger in the store. I mean, you're not missing much. Five, ten dollars, your life worth more than that. And while police arrived within minutes, the store manager still plans on installing a panic alarm as soon as possible. Police have still made no arrests. In East Harlem, Christy Kalishian, CBS 2 News.